Where does the time go? As 2021 comes to an end, we wanted to take a moment to look back on one of the busiest years our team has ever had. Our designers outdid themselves with renovations of all sizes. Kitchens, bathrooms, even laundry rooms, fireplaces, and closet spaces. And the opportunity to partner with some local organizations, such as the LeBron James Foundation and the Strongsville Senior and Recreational Center. And our artisans, they stayed just as busy. From polished countertops and custom furniture to a Parisian-inspired stair railing fabricated from ornamental iron. We began the year with the national launch of the Fittings Metal Collection. A new line created to elevate interiors using metal accents. And over the course of this year, it's grown tremendously. With numerous trade partners across the United States, in October, it won the KBB Product of the Year Award. And while we're on the subject of awards, I should mention that our owner, James Justice, was recognized as one of the KBDN innovators for 2021, as well as Crane's 2021 Notable Entrepreneur. And while the year was full of notable awards and new beginnings, it was also marked with some loss. In November, James and Darlene made the hard decision to close the Architectural Justice Gallery and Cafe location so that they could focus their attention on the Design Center and on the new Fittings Metal Collection. And while that was challenging, it still pales in comparison to the loss we experienced back in March when we lost our dear friend and colleague, Elizabeth. Her memory lives on with all who knew and loved her. Beginning the spring, Architectural Justice will award a design scholarship each year in her memory. Because remembering just how far we've come is important. That's why this year we celebrated our 35th year anniversary with an all-out ladies' night extravaganza. And so many of you showed up for it. We want to extend our thanks to all of you, our clients and friends, for entrusting us this year with your projects. Your kind reviews have made all the difference, so thank you. And here's to another year at Architectural Justice. <laughs>